Hi, Katie Schmidt here, and I want to show you today how I apply my Jamberry Juniors to my three-year-old, and they last on her for at least two weeks. We actually just took hers off after being two weeks old just because she wanted Christmas ones. So, as you can see, I've already done her first one here. We're doing Santa belts. So, the first, uh, you, the important thing about Juniors is that you want to prepare them really well. So, wash their hands with Dawn soap or vinegar or uh, kids get a lot of oils on their nails so we want to try to get not have that first thing I do is I scrape the cuticle now I already did this on her because I like to do this in the beginning um, on all of her nails so they're not gonna see a 10 come up but she does have a lot of visible cuticle which I think is pretty common with kids and then I like to wipe it with an alcohol swab and I brush it and she likes to help. So she is buffing right now. There you go. And then we're going to size up which one is going to fit. Okay. And then I'm going to cut I will it. do this one. Okay. Okay, once I get that on my tweezers, I'm going to heat it up on the heater. Or your blow dryer works. And I'm going to place it on the nail. Now I do it really lightly at first, especially on her t tiny little nails. Hold on one second. Okay. And then that way I can pick it up and fix it if I need. And then we're going to smooth it down. She wants to use the rubber, cut rubber cuticle pusher to smooth it a little bit. And I find that really a good way to keep her interested is to let her help. So she likes to do the she likes to push down her cuticles. She likes to do the buffer block. She and um, as long as I just go through and make sure that it's that it's Dental. done well, we're good. So once it's on there pretty well, you could put a good amount of pressure. I now some people use rice bags, and I will make a video for that another day. Um, but I've found it's easier just to use the heater and count to three and that way it's fast they're not there's not too much heat on their little fingers um, but you're still getting the heat that you need to make these stay so ready yeah. one two three hot. hot and then we'll smooth it down one more really good time Thank lots you. and lots of pressure yep let me do it first and then it'll be, it'll be your turn there you go now uh, when she's finishing that i'll talk about this real fast um, on my nails, I tend to file to create the seal, um, but on hers, they're yeah. so little that it's really, really hard to do that, and so I use nail clippers, and so I just don't clip her nails until I'm ready to do um, her Jamicure, and so as you see here, the excess on her nail, I'm just going to cut her nail with that excess, so, and that is going to create the seal that you need without having to file. I like to get if those corners help, really good. I can push this like you Just like that. Like this. Now we'll do one more. Hope we don't need those, that tool today. Where's that? So I'm gonna wipe her good and clean. And then we're going to buffer block. Now you wanna do I, the buffer? I want to do the wiping first. Okay, that's fine. Good. That makes it nice and clean, huh? Okay, and then we choose our size. Santa belts. Santa belts. Santa belts. Santa belts. Doing this tour today? Maybe. Good. All okay. right, we're going to put those on our tweezers, heat them up on your heater or your blow dryer for about three, four, five seconds. And then we will place it softly. Remember not to put it down too hard because especially on these teeny nails, it's hard to get it right the first time. That way, hold on one second, maybe. And that way I can kind of pick it up on the edge I know that's not gonna need, um, not gonna be on her nail and replace it where I need. And then some good pressure. Push. Go ahead and do your cuticle. 
Squisher. Squeezer. Perfect. Now let's heat them up. Hot. One, two, three. Hot, hot, hot. And then we're just going to make sure that nothing's touching the skin. And if it is, you can take either your scissors or some cuticle clippers and clip away any excess nail wrap. Um, it's most important, especially on these little girls, that there's no nail wrap touching cuticle and there's no um, nail wrap touching skin because they will pop right off if they're touching. And then we're going to clip. You see we're multitasking here. She's ready for that next nail. And then we created that seal that's going to keep those on there. And these will last her another two weeks at least. And that's it. Thank you.